Hi, my name is Dr. Rebecca Kukemeyer. I've been an audiologist for nearly 25 years. I specialize in helping improve marriages and relationships by helping others hear better and improve communication. So one of the highlights of my, my uh, job, I'm gonna have a patient come in. He's gonna get hearing aids for the first time. He's a young guy. He definitely needs them. He's recognized that he needs them. And so for the first time, he's gonna get them. And I'm pretty excited about that. Excited to see how he does with them. Everybody thinks they're too young for hearing aids. Once they get the hearing aids on, I think that idea just flies out the window because they really don't care what the hearing aids look like to them, even though you don't really see them. I think they're more interested in how well they hear and how much easier it is to communicate. Oftentimes when I get a patient who comes into the office for the first time, they've never had a hearing test, they're usually reticent about doing anything about it. But what I find more often than not, and one of the comments I hear very frequently is they wish they would have done something sooner. Oftentimes people will put off seeking treatment for hearing loss for whatever reason, whether it's vanity, whether it's the stigma of hearing aids, whatever it is, the cost. But once they do it, they wish they would have done it sooner. So that's a resounding comment that I hear frequently. I can see even in the office setting, there's a lot more communication going on. There's more talking going on. Sometimes when I see patients, they're not the ones reporting their case history. The spouse does the case history because the patient has so much trouble hearing the questions, they almost need an interpreter. Uh, and it's interesting to see that once that they get hearing aids, how that can change. The dynamics of the relationship changes and the spouse is no longer the person who's interpreting. That the patient can now answer for themselves and communicate and let me know what's going on with them. So oftentimes I do see marriage relationships improving because there's less stress, there's less strain on the marriage when both partners can hear and they can communicate easier. It is surprising how far people will drive to get to Pemberville for our services. And I think that speaks volumes about what we've been doing for the last 17 years here.